In the Moscow Office of Memorial staff post the latest information they have about their murdered friend and colleague. News of her death has shaken Russia's fragile human rights movements to the core. This was Natalia Estimrova at work in the Chechen capital Grozny. Up until last week, she had been collecting evidence on alleged atrocities carried out by Chechen forces under the authority of the Kremlin-appointed president of Chechnya, Ramzan Kadyrov. Estimrova's colleagues are under no doubt over who was behind the murder. The authorities of the Chechen Republic, and first of all the President of the Republic, Ramzan Kadyrov, who once directly threatened her and regarded her as his enemy, are to be blamed for her murder. All our investigations have to do with what we call governmental terror in Chechnya. Let's call things by their right names. It's governmental terror when the leadership carries out illegal violence. This was her main task. On Wednesday, Memorial confirmed Estimarova's body had been found in neighboring Ingushetia with two bullet wounds to the head. They had been fired at close range. Eyewitnesses had described how she had been forcibly taken from her home by men in civilian clothing, even managing to shout out that she was being kidnapped. Estimarova had received numerous international awards for her work. Friends say she was aware of the dangers but committed to her job. She was that one person whom the victims trusted fully, to whom the victims would come and talk, despite all their fears, despite being crushed by fright. Russia recently ended a counter-terrorism operation in Chechnya after a 10-year military presence in the Republic. They handed over full authority to President Kadyrov, entrusting him to rebuild the country. But Chechnya and its neighbors are still home to Islamist rebels committed to fighting the pro-Kremlin authorities. Both sides have been accused of committing atrocities, but activists had expressed increasing concern about the methods the Chechen leadership have been using to stamp out the insurgency. Estimarova's execution-style killing is chillingly similar to the 2006 murder of journalist Anna Politkovskaya, another outspoken critic of the Kremlin's military operations in Chechnya. Her case is still unsolved. Both President Dmitry Medvedev and the Chechen President Ramzan Kadyrov have expressed outrage at the killing. An investigation into her murder has been ordered. Estimirova's death is the latest in a series of killings of journalists and human rights defenders in Russia. Her murder has been condemned both at home and abroad, shattering any illusion that may have existed about stability in Chechnya. Neve Barker, Al Jazeera, Moscow.